what's up? This is Sifu Cuddle, and for this Kung Fu combination, we're gonna be working with the spear. All right, so go ahead and grab your spear, and let's get to work. Now, spear is always a long range weapon. You're gonna do a little bit of short range techniques here and there, but for the most part, when you're, when you're using the spear, it's all about being direct. You get straight to the point. <laughs> all right, so first position, we're gonna start from a square horse stance, and then we're gonna shift back to a cat stance, I'm gonna use a redirect. Now I can either use this to block to the side, to block on the other side, or I can use the front end of the spear to block as well. But I'm gonna take my back hand and drop it over my head so the spear comes all the way over to this side. Come back with a press in that same stance. Now from here, I'm gonna lunge forward with my front foot, thrust the spear all the way out, and then I'm gonna return back to that horse stance and press down, slicing with the spear. So again, I have that cat stance over the head, back to center, now straight in towards my target, and then pull back. So you have one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay? Even though this is a simple technique, this is one of your big fundamentals for spear. So if you're interested in using the spear, do this one a million times. And I'm not kidding on that one. The more you do spear, the better you're gonna get. Spear is much more difficult than using a staff. It's, uh, it's, the technique is more finite. You have to really pay attention to small things, okay? So work on this, work on this, work on this, all right? If you like this combination, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe. Till next time, this is Sifu Cuddle. Bam, fist with a foe out.